going to start off here with the Digitech Trio. The Digitech Trio is a new kind of pedal. It's a band creator. It's a pedal that allows you to be able to create a bass part and a drum part, and you can actually use it for songs. You can use it for getting yourself to play better guitar. You can do it as a solo gig. I mean, it's a terrific tool. So I'm just going to play some chords and create something very simple. There's no computer involved. There's no programming. I'm doing it real time. It just learns my progression. So I can bury it now that I've got a groove. where it just begins. So I've laid down a groove. I want to vary the groove now. So I'm going to actually go through the variations of that groove because this is not static. It's not actually using looping and we're not recording. So I'm going to start stepping through some variations. The bass changes a little bit, the drums will change. hat opens up a little bit and the drum groove starts to vary let's move it again let's do it again and now let's start to get it to shuffle. right down let's speed it back up and let's go quite a bit faster the pitch stays the same the bass doesn't start getting weird the drums don't start getting weird they don't start pitching out weird it's absolutely I'm, I'm quite a bit faster Let's do some guitar effects. That's inside the box, the distortion. So you can see, there's an incredible amount of things that you can do with just two chords. Now what happens when you use more chords? So I'm going to do something now that's the opposite and I'm going to use a jazz progression and use all kinds of chords and upright bass. We're going to change the entire genre. So I've armed it. It's ready to learn my new progression. I'm going to go to a clean sound. All right, here we go. Or may not be the way I want it, but I can change and vary it. Oh, that's a 
little bit more like the way I want, but I want it even to swing more. Ah, here we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. This is what I want. tambourine loving it it's changing all the time it's varying by parts it's not just the remaining static this is so important to understand that it's constantly quite organic That's again showing all these complex chords. So whether you're a simple player, whether you're a complex player, the Digitech Trio works perfectly in any environment. You've got seven different genres. You've got 12 variations within each genre. That's a lot of possibilities. You can combine those. You can combine part one, part two, part three, and each one having those 12 variations, you don't run out of ideas. So it's an ultimate tool for learning songs. It's a great way to be able, if you're a singer songwriter and you want to learn parts for a new song that you're writing, or if you want to teach a guitar player just how to groove. I mean, nothing better than, wow, I'm going to show you jazz and not just play a scale. You can shift it. All of a sudden now showed a guitar player that I can groove, I can actually move. It's not just like, here's a scale, here's a chord. It's actually giving me feel and teaching me something about music that is the essential element of music, and that's how to be able to make things work together in an actual real environment. So this bass and this drum is actually giving me chances to write something very creative and not just be static. So, as I want to conclude here, the Digitech Trio will be available in March. It's going to be in stores. It is a band creator. It does a bass part and a drum part so intuitively with seven genres, 12 different variations, and you've got any speed within really slow to really fast. You've got guitar effects built inside. It's a great complete package. Thanks for your time. My name is Mark Cooper. Hope to see you again.